everybody, yeah, it's your daily hour with me. There's the title, look, it's Luke. Hey Luke, how you doing today? What the hell does that say? Yeah, we don't even it know. It says something? It says something. In the future though, we don't know what it says yet. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, that's like an episode uh, name title space that you can put an episode name title in. Yeah, if we, you do, want. we do that afterwards. Yeah, yeah, post-production so stuff. Yeah, that's like, we only do like two post things. We do that, yeah. and then we do, at the very end, there's one other thing too. But it's just like titles. So. Yep. So we're going to figure out, because we don't know what the title of the program is yet, because we don't know what we're going to do yet. So what's going to happen? Yeah, so once we figure out what's going to happen, it'll we'll put it on there. <laughs> And we'll get that going. Well, what happens here on the program, though, we turn on the machines, then we start talking. We talk for one hour, and we talk about anything we want that's going to go through the hour. Yeah, the machines are on. Yeah, they're going and we're talking, so it's happening. What so, is happening? Like, oh, man, I just, you've got McDonald's stickers on your switcher there. Oh, yeah. That's something else. Tons of stickers. Those are the stickers <laughs> you get when you get special <laughs> orders. Oh, yeah. When was the last time you were on the program? It's been about a month or so. A month. Last month? Either was, it, was it last Oh, month? no. I guess it's October now, though. It's yeah, been, yeah. Was it September or August? It was like before September even, because like September is when I did the Dance Early Dance show. Yeah. And I came in a few weeks before that to promote that episode of Dance Early Dance. How did that go? That went good. Yeah. Went, uh, I mean, I was really worried that it was going to be an under, a way under-attended show. It was yeah. still under-attended in my book, but... Not as dreadful as I was worrying about it being. So uh, it went okay. We moderately attended. It was moderately attended. That's pretty good. Yeah, yeah. So you uh, you did it. Is I it worked my butt off to make it moderately attended, and yeah. it was moderately attended. So is it happening again? Yeah, in a. Uh, It'll, it will, the October episode will have just happened by the time this episode is on the air. So... It's on, like... Last uh, Friday, or it's going to be on... This, uh, uh, October 7th. October Octo 7th. Oh, yeah, yeah, so we just missed it. So that's in two days for us, though, but not for you guys out there. Yep, yep. In TV. Yep. Well, that's going to be fun. Is that, so you, are you doing that one again, or...? Uh, no, the next episode that I do the music for is going to be December... Oh. Yeah, so I'm working my butt off trying to make a good December episode. Are you going to do uh, holiday stuff? or? Oh, no. I, I, I never do holiday stuff. All right. <laughs> Not me. Hey, it's the Columbus Day special. Oh, no. Yeah, because next week right is now? Columbus Day. Yeah. Or when we're on the air, is going to be Columbus Day? Yeah, so this is the holiday special. So. Oh, my. This is where we do stuff that's... The genocide the holiday. holiday. Yeah. Oh, my. So that's what we're doing. Yeah. <laughs> It's actually Columbus Day traditional, and there's another thing that says Columbus Day observed. That was two days ago. Oh, yeah. Never so heard of the difference between observed and actual on that holiday. Yeah, I guess they're all observed. I don't really know what the actual day is. It only took them probably a lot longer than a day to do anything. I don't know what the... <laughs> <laughs> We're going to anchor our ships in your bay here, and it's going to take me about three weeks to do that. So y'all chill. We'll yeah. be over there to uh, contaminate your culture and run you into the ground in just a while. Give us a minute or so. Yeah. It's yeah. It's the real. It's the holiday today. So I don't know what, what. Even I mean, not even, not even what the holiday is supposed to be about though. But I don't even know what, what we're supposed to do for the holiday. Yeah. Well, the only thing I never heard about was attending a parade. Oh okay. Yeah, they used to have Columbus Day parades. At least when I was a kid. I don't know what they're doing nowadays. Yeah, yeah, well, it's too rare. It's not the weather can't handle parades in the winter. Maybe here, maybe they have them in other places. Columbus Day parades or something. Yeah, when I was a kid, I was living in San Francisco, and there the weather is better for uh, parades this time of year. So that's when they had this parade that I remember. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Well, that's the we no, we got actually we had no messages today. What? Looking at the messages, nobody called in, so that <laughs> okay. was on a, on a Tuesday night. <laughs> Let's see, what, I don't know what, what happened last Tuesday that nobody was watching, but nobody called in. You guys got to call in more often. I don't know who's out there watching the show, but if you are watching the show, call this number right here because we do the show every day. It ends with a two. Remember that. And we are local in Thurston County because 
this area code, it doesn't matter. So if you have those cell phones, you can call anywhere. And I don't know if you have a home phone, if it's going to be long distance or not. I haven't figured that out. But we are local to Thurston County. We're supposed to be 360, but we have a different phone number. But I think we're going to get back the old phone number at some point. Uh, Freddie will be here in a little bit, and he'll talk to us about that. But we're going to change our phone number back to a 360 number. Oh. It's, it's so confusing. Interesting. For some of the viewers out there, yeah. Yeah, that 330 thing, that's some sort of uh, web uh, link hookup thing. Yeah. Directory, you know, Whoa. directs you from where the hell you're calling from. Doesn't matter, yeah. It's... Hey. Yeah, someone's... What's all this? Hey, connectors, get your act together. Connect. Whoa, <laughs> whoa. Something's happening. <laughs> We're losing the machines. Yeah, something's happening in the background, in the background there, so... That's too bad. Well, I guess we'll just get right to it. Let's call Freddy, see where he's at. He's probably on his way here, actually, but... Yeah, we're going to call him on his cell phone, make him answer while he's driving, and make him have an accident. Oh, well, don't say that. <laughs> I don't want to jinx that process by saying that. Yeah, let's hopefully that, that thing doesn't happen that you said before. Yeah. Whoa. Freddy. He's going to make it. Freddy on the road. Yeah, he's probably on the road, so we want to answer the phone, or he's right outside, so... He's being safe and stuff. That's probably good. Yeah. <laughs> so, have you seen anything, uh, interesting on the streets in the last week or so? Hey, you reached Freddy Dober. No. I can't come to the phone right now. Whenever I go on the streets, it's all boring. I'll call you back as soon as I can. Thanks a lot. Oh. Hey, Freddy, it's the program. You'll probably be here soon. All right, bye-bye. Let's yeah. See. Yeah. That was Freddy. You got us some toys. Ooh, ooh. Look at it. I'm gonna get this thing going. Ooh, ooh. We'll get a. Ooh. We'll get a close-up cam here. If we can get a clock cam going. This is a. This is a doll that my mother bought me. It's a toy for your mother. Monster doll. My mother likes to promote my playing with dolls. Apparently. Yeah. That's no, that's not true. I just told her I like to collect figurines, so she buys me these things. So you, you told her you didn't just uh, she didn't just get you out of nowhere, right? No. Yeah, gotta ask for it. That's a pretty uh, crazy one. I can't find the remote. We're not gonna be able to, unless we f look for the remote. We find the remote that we can use. Oh, there it is. Okay, there it get, is. We can get the clock cam going. We can see it. The blue it screen is. of death. Yeah. Sorry about it, everybody. It's the blue screen of death. I hope nobody's dying. Yeah. That would be Red bad. screen. Yeah, now we're... <laughs> Let's see. Oh, there it is. So there's the toy. Ooh, scary. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty freaky. So That's you know that... What's, you know the name of the toy? No, I wish. You know, I was. I heard I was coming over here, and I looked on the net briefly to find it, but I couldn't find it in time. It would take a long time to find this, the name of this toy. It's in from Ultraman. Unless, unless it's really written on there, and I you can read it. Because I can't read that stuff because my glasses I, are not here with me. Uh, it says Made in China, and yeah. then I think something in Chinese. Oh, well. So, it's 90, it says 1995, though. Not helping us much. 1995, made in China, so. Yeah. Can't read that. That's quite a nice brain sticking out. It's freaky. Brain, muscles, eye muscles, tentacles. Yeah. All the good stuff Pretty that people freaky. love. <laughs> All right, here, let's call. We can call somebody else. Let's see. We'll call on a call. Uh, Angie. Okay, Angie. Get Angie. ready. To, get ready to be called. Yeah, she was supposed to be here tomorrow. Oh yeah, today. Um, Maggie. She was supposed to be here, but. Uh, oh yeah. She didn't show up, so we're gonna call her. We'll find out what happened with her. She canceled. Uh, we'll find out. So Luke is a a sub. Substitute. Uh, yeah, that's good to get though. I mean, I didn't know. We didn't have any plans. I didn't. I don't know what I was gonna do. Almost have to do a show by myself, which happens every once in a while. Yeah. But it's uh, that's not as I interesting because then I have to talk to myself for a long time. <laughs> and <laughs> self. I've done what are that. you all about, self? What's the most interesting part of yourself, self? <laughs> yeah, it, it, <laughs> it gets it, that happens. <laughs> uh oh. 
please enter a valid number. Hey, I don't remember chirping birds the last time I was on the show. Uh, We've got the wave sound, which I remember, but the chirping bird seems new to me. They are... They're, they're, I don't know. They're there now. They've been there for a while. I mean, sometimes they're on and off. I have uh, the option turning them on and off on the thing. So. Yeah. But I... Oh. But the first you called has a voice mailbox that has not been set up yet. Oh, yeah. Uh -oh. That old thing. That's bad. Yeah, you guys got to set up your voicemail boxes. A lot of people out there. Hey, I haven't set up mine. I don't know how. I don't... I'm, just, I'm afraid. I'm afraid of it. You have to call your own phone number. Yeah. This brain and thing. Then, oh, what? And then go through, like, menus of options and stuff. Yeah, yeah. For some reason, that scares me. I don't know. Yeah, but then nobody can leave you a voicemail. So if you ever, ever get phone calls... Then how are they gonna uh, leave you a message like this? Oh yeah, the on this uh, wonderful device. phone thing. Yeah. Here. yeah. How is that gonna happen? This thing looks like a boot from the back. I thought <laughs> it was a boot. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully, yeah. So yeah, you get this thing. Because otherwise, you're, you're probably getting all these phone calls, and then when when you don't answer your phone, it goes to this thing, and people are like, "Oh, I wanted to leave you a message, but they don't want to keep calling you." So then the only way to call you is to call you a bunch of times until you answer. Yep. And then you're going to lose okay, contacts. Okay, I, 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 he I hear you, Kenny. I hear you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I might... Because it might be poor you trying to call me up one day on this cell phone. Yeah, it happens on the program a good amount when we call and then it says their voicemail has not been set up yet. But I think a lot of people these days don't even use voicemail anyway. We're kind of telling people moving on. Uh, the electricity has vanished from my telephone. Uh-oh, you it's dead? Yeah, time to plug it in one day again. Here, let's call a McDonald's. Stuff to do, McDonald's. yeah. McDonald's. Every time you call McDonald's, they always say, what? What? They can never hear you, what yeah. you're saying on the first try. Why can't they? I don't know, but other people can hear me usually, so it's something wrong with McDonald's phone. It's not my phone. Yeah. It's like, do you have the orange pumpkin flavored milkshake again? And they're like, what? Say what? Say what? What? So you, I just realized you're going to be doing your Danso dance. Arts Walk is going to be happening. That's right. This October Danso only dance competes with Arts Walk, and that's always a, a bitch. That happened. I, I remember that time. happening many years ago too, and I've done, I like had to choose. Oh yeah, you were in the position of choosing. Yeah. yeah. I think I did go to Danso dance that one time though, but there was not very many people there because it was Arts Walk at the same time. Yep. That happens every October. That's why every October episode of Dance or Dance is usually underattended. <laughs> so why why didn't they move it to uh, uh, I don't like know Florida week or something? That's all the producer's uh, uh, so prerogative, and he doesn't want to do it. Is that how you generally judge the success of the Dance or Dances? Do you like go through them? You like underattended, underattended, yeah, moderately attended? That's how I do it. <laughs> How not? many people are boogieing to this episode? Yeah. That's, that's how I do it. Yeah. Are you the one that's editing the anthologies? Yeah, I am. I watched that one. Yeah, the anthologies that come on after Dance Holy Dance. Yeah. yeah. Or is after this program, too? Is that, did really? you do that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Did you I went through all the old tapes. I go through all the old tapes of the old show and uh, find the stuff I like best. Stick them all together and make an anthology episode. Yeah. So you watched hours of dan the dancing videos? Yeah, I did. <laughs> Whoa. Hours and hours. <laughs> and then you're like, this part is better than this other dancing part. Um, yeah, did you guys put it on after the show on purpose? or did it, is that I something did. You, you I did? wanted that slot. After after Dance Holy Dance, I wanted the anthology to come on. But after after this show, too, the, after the daily hour, I saw it, yeah. Oh, wow. They're doing it then, too? Yeah. Are that, they just that, that, was not, there? that was not my asking. Maybe that's just the programming people. Uh -oh. Yeah, they're just taking some initiative, which is okay. That's good. So I think it's great that the anthology would, would follow this show. Yeah. They're putting on a lot of... Because uh, this show rocks, and then you have another show that rocks, and it makes a, a whole solid block of shows that rock. They're showing that on the thing, yeah. They're... Um, they're uh, they're showing a lot of things after this show, so I think maybe they're doing that on purpose. Do we think that it's just because it's late night that programmers can just go nuts and do whatever they want? Yeah. Know? Well, hopefully we're building an audience. Maybe they've realized that. 
because there's a lot of people who want to watch the show, you know, after, after this show, there's a lot of viewers, and then after this show happens, they be TCTV, they want to fill the slots. Yeah. So stay tuned after this show, something might be on there, <laughs> I don't know what it might be, but... <laughs> But where maybe you guys, you viewers out there, you're uh, you're showing your your uh, your watcher, your viewership by uh, by doing this for us, and then so now you're then you can watch the shows afterwards too. You viewers, your power is in your viewerhood. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, viewers. So here, I'm going to try to call this other McDonald's. Oh, there's that picture of that lady. Who is that picture of that? Sue Reynolds. Sue Reynolds. You know what I've always wanted to do to Sue Reynolds' picture? What's that? I wanted to kiss it. All right. <laughs> Give me the... <laughs> it's on the... It's, can you see? It's right there. Oh, yeah, this there thing. It it's yeah. got your skate... Yeah, you can move that thing. That's... that. You can just Sue Reynolds, oh, oh. you're hot. I just want to kiss your image. Hello, McDonald's. Hello? <laughs> Hi, do you guys have the autumn milkshakes yet? Excuse me? Do you guys have the autumn milkshakes? Autumn? No, we don't. Oh, do you know if you're going to get any of those in soon? No, I have no idea. Oh, okay. Thank you. Uh-huh, bye-bye. That was McDonald's in California, San Diego, California. I'm going to kiss this. He's doing it. I'm going to kiss the Sue Reynolds picture. Mwah. He's done it. Kiss Sue Reynolds. I've, I've just wanted to do that for quite a while after watching episodes of this program. That's what you thought, yeah. <laughs> That's it. Here, sit there. Maybe more people will want to do that after this. I'm setting a precedent, but yeah. I'm also spreading germs. Yeah, maybe, maybe <laughs> you're going to cause a, ger a germ problem. Oh, no. No, actually, I don't I don't find the, the Sue Reynolds image that attractive. It's just I wanted to do that for a gag. So there it is. The gag has been done. That's good. Let's get, okay, let me try to get this uh, little Ooh. square going. Yeah, look at this. Ghost Yeah. <laughs> whoa, whoa. So switch sides and get a little, uh, get a little box of... Uh, negativity. Yeah, negative box. Or like this, though. See? There it is, yeah. This is the box of negativity right, right here. here. Like, Everything whoa. else is positive, except for right in my head. You know, that's kind of... A metaphor for the way I actually am. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of Mr. Negativity. He's in the negative zone. <laughs> yeah, you, yeah. You, you don't see the the bright side of things. No, I miss the bright side of things. It's like yeah. people show me the bright th side of things, and I say, "What? What? I don't get it. What are you talking about? I totally miss it." Yeah. All right. Is that a <laughs> is that affecting you? Your life? Negative negative attitude or? Oh, totally. Yeah. Yeah. I reap all the uh, ex you know, all the consequences you'd expect from that. Uh -huh. like, hi. hi, McDonald's. Hello. 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 Yes. Okay. Do you guys have Do you guys have the orange milkshakes yet, or still? I mean. I'm sorry. Do you guys still have those orange milkshakes? Yes. Oh, you do. That's good. Do you know how much more of that you have left? I'm gonna lost them. You wanna you wanna take one of these calls? The McDonald's call? That sounds scary. What, yeah. I don't know what I would say. Yeah, I don't know either. Well, then, okay, that's okay. You can say no. You don't need it's to take like the call. I, I don't want to take these calls to McDonald's. Yeah. So that's good. Tomorrow is Sue Cat. I'm looking at the thing too. I don't know what that is. We'll find out more about uh -huh. that tomorrow. This holiday, Sue Cat. Oh, it's a holiday. It's a holiday. In this nation? Uh, on this calendar. The calendar is what we follow here on the program, so. Huh. Sukkot. Oh! I think that's a Jewish one. Yeah, it might, it might, it might be. There's Jewish holidays on here, too. So. I think Sukkot, when they have a, a, a special meal in a gazebo-like thing. Yeah, okay. That's what I think that is about. That's that's good. Well, no messages. So we got we we already called. Try to call Freddie. Check the messages. Oh oh, there's time for commercial. Ding.
What's the dream phone? Woo! Yeah, where's you know, the, the dream phone? It's not the phone you dream about. It's the phone you dream that you tell your dreams to. Tell your dreams to the dream phone, everybody. Yeah. Oh, little red outside the red zone. Oh, and it's the smooth or the, <laughs> the herky jerky zone too now. I think, or maybe they're both. Oh yeah, our, our motion is getting digitized. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Up, here, down, here, up here, here, down here, up here, down here, up here, down here. Zone. Yeah. Oh yeah, we're gonna try to get this thing fixed. Uh, somebody, Mike, Mike Aiky, he's gonna help us with fixing the machines so that we uh, we don't have this red zone because this bottom zone's all red for some reason. The regular zone's the correct colors, and we're going to know why exactly that's happening, but we're going to get it repaired. Oh, soon. that's not on purpose. I thought it was on purpose. No, the red zone is it's part of this machine. The, red, the machine is, is used, and it came like this, and it came messed up. Oh. And we're going to get it fixed so it's not in the red zone. I think one of the colors is out or something. Yeah, yeah, totally. Like the green is out. Is out the to green? Lunch. Something. If the green was out to make everything red. Yeah, I guess so. I don't really know how that stuff works. Yeah. But somebody else does, and we're going to get it fixed. We will get it fixed. Yeah. Well, we're doing a late night program because, well, yeah, Maggie didn't show up. We can call Maggie because she was supposed to be here uh, earlier today. But uh, the we have Luke. So if I've been, yeah. I don't know, about a third of the people don't show up to the program. And uh, so. It will be under attended, too. Yeah. But I, I only usually invite one person, so I try to enter, enter or try to fill the schedule out. Sometimes I end up doing solo shows and stuff. But I also I always try to promote the shows in the future, but about one third of the time they don't even happen. So yeah. I don't know if I, I should still be doing that. <laughs> hey, Maggie, it's the program. <laughs> hey, program, I'm so sorry I couldn't come on today. Did you get my message? I got the message, yeah. All right, I apologize. How's the program today? We have a we have a sub. I am the sub. Oh yeah. He's you're, he's you're he's trying to live up to you. What? Yeah, I've never even met Maggie, and I, I'm I'm feeling intimidated by trying to live up to Maggie here. This, <laughs> he's, what? He's subbing, he's subbing for you, so he, I, I've been saying that you're gonna come here, but now. Everybody, they, they've been, you know, they've been waiting for your arrival on TV, the viewers, and then they turn on the TV yeah. and they like, <laughs> Maggie, are, are you charismatic and stuff? Am I what? Charismatic. Do you have... Uh, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Charisma. <laughs> Luke's going to try to top it. So you, what, you, you have a lot of homework? Um, I had so much homework to do today. It was nuts. <laughs> yeah, you, you're doing um, you doing math. Yeah. You're doing like trig trigonometry. No, not trig. <laughs> what is it? What's the fancy like, What's uh, the fancy thing that you're studying in math? Uh, what am I doing? Yeah, Wait, big, what are you asking? Big math words. Oh, um, a big math word. What's your big math word of the day? What are you doing with that? Yeah. But, but, right, well, right now I'm doing, um, well, the three subjects I'm studying are abstract algebra, real analysis, and set theory. And I don't know if I have a big math word of the day. Yeah, I guess it wouldn't be, I um, think that, that <laughs> there's not really... That's kind of the opposite of math, maybe it was a word, the big math words. How about an icon, how about an icon vector? Yeah, what's that? I don't know. So, I mean, I don't really want to know what it is, but that's what's, a big word. What's, how about asymptoped? Did you get that one yet? It, it's, well, it's like a vector. It's a transformation vector where, like, it doesn't change your angle. You? But it just, like, extends a vector. It stretches it. What about asymptote? Or uh, <laughs> Do you know what that Asymptotes is? Asymptotes are like, what about, what? What is, what is that? I don't know what it is. Do yeah, you, did you, did you, know. did you learn about asymptotes yet? Yeah, I have. What is that? I don't know I, what that I is. I know. Cool. Is An asymptote is like a, like a point on a, like, 
I guess on a graph or like in a function where um, you like your function can approach it but can't actually reach it, just but like sort of based on the rules of the function. Whoa. Yeah. Ding ding or ding. Or like ding, an ding. algebra. Oh yeah, you know that. All right, that's good. Well, hey Maggie, do you want to reschedule yourself? Yes, I would actually really like to because I'd really like to go on the program. I just yeah. We're all we're all booked up. Uh, Tomorrow is at 2, Friday is at 2, Saturday is at 3. Uh, um, sorry, keep going. <laughs> the, the next open day we have is the 18th of October. The 18th of October, that's next, like, that's next, when? Next Tuesday. Like a week from yesterday? Or like a, two weeks? Two weeks. Wait, yeah, okay. three, in two um, w Well, when on Tuesday? Would it be like nighttime on Tuesday? Yeah, sure. If we could do nighttime or do, yeah, either. Um, I work. Well, I work until eight on Tuesday. Oh, would you rather have a, would you rather have a Friday or a Thursday? Um, a Thursday would be ideal. Okay, and what time on Thursday? Uh, any time that's not three to six. Okay, how about one? 1 p.m. One would work, yes. All right, you're scheduled for that day. That's going to be International right. Credit Union Day. Oh, wow, that's exciting. October 20th. <laughs> okay. That's okay. six days before my birthday. Oh, Freddie is here. Okay, well, thanks, Maggie. We'll talk to you later. <laughs> you're welcome. All right, bye-bye. The Freddy, I, uh, I guess I'll go open the door. You want to? Can you can you hold down the program for like I'm holding ten it seconds? Down. Yeah. You gotta keep talking. Hi, I'm still talking. We're we're gonna get we're gonna get Freddy. He's at the door. Oh yeah. What is what is your problem, man? <laughs> Why are your nails painted? What did we miss? What are you, some kind of weirdo? What did you do? Oh, did Freddie just <laughs> what got a miss? <laughs> what? No, I got this in Seattle earlier today. Oh, all right, that's good. Because don't don't go to the subway across the street. Oh, no, do not do that. I, I would not. food. This was, uh, this was a desperate, <laughs> hunger-driven buy. Yeah. I mean, I like subways Seattle. in general, kind of. Not really, though. I mean, I'd rather get other stuff. But uh, It's not the best sub sandwiches, but they're the same every time. Yeah. You can always count on it. But it's right across the street from McConey's here, and that's kind of bad. The McConaughey's were there for years, and then they uh, opened the subway across the street. They're like, "Hey, wow, this seems like a seems like more sub sandwiches are sold here in Olympia than anywhere else. It's a great spot, right?" Yeah, that was uh, that was bad. Don't go. So, Luke, you have to you have to catch a bus. You might uh, is that the last bus out of here is 11:30, right? Or from yeah. from downtown. But then, do you know about it the buses like out of I here? I've got another uh, 28 minutes before I got a split. Yeah. Oh, you have another 28 minutes, so you'll be able to make it for. We only have about 30 minutes left on the show. So yeah, maybe yeah. a little bit more than that, though. So you, you're gonna miss the last like this, like five minutes of the show. Yeah, that's the way we planned it. Yeah. Well, that's gonna work it's out. It's going down just like that. Yeah. Yeah. See, Mr. Ginsu, we have a plan. That's the way we planned it. <laughs> we've, been, we've been planning this stuff. Yeah, Mr. Gintsu, he like... He, Does he, he hassle you about having no plan? No, he hassles me about... He, he thought that I was supposed to say that we... That we have a plan. We don't have a plan. No, we don't ever plan. He, he thinks, well... He's like, wow, you guys, I caught you guys planning. But we do plan, and that's fine. Yep. That's the one that we were looking for. We, I think he just saw some of the episodes where we did not plan and just yeah. said, that's how it goes. <laughs> stuff happens and we try it to took plan some planning. Sometimes. We, we, we try it out to plan. Yeah, you don't think all happens. this stuff happened without a little bit of planning here. All yeah, these all these stuff showed up, yeah. yeah. You know how many cables we have. We yeah. have to have a, some kind of plan. Well, hey, Freddie, how's that, how's that production end going? Now that you hear it's like you're on the, we try to call you on the phone too. Yeah, oh, yeah. That's okay, but you're here now, so how do you, oh. Half hey. hour, Mark. Is this the old background tape? Mm, no. Oh, okay. okay. What? That's not the. No, I uh, it's got I dubbed it. Uh, oh, you redubbed it. Yeah. Our production end is going well. Um, I need to grab some tapes from you, but aside from that, we've been keeping up to date. I was gonna see if we could call uh, see Heather, Summer, and Oscar on TV a week ago. So that's like our time today. Mm-hmm. Um. Well, I don't know. Whatever. It, but it's going well. It's exciting because it's, you know, the day after it airs, it'll be up on YouTube. And that's how it's supposed to work, I guess. 
I mean, really, it'd be better if we could just do it as soon as we filmed it. And we're trying to, once we get the monitor, that'll be good. Oh, yeah, we're going to try to get that monitor from, from uh, Martis there. That's, uh, that's pretty good. So, oh, it's... We should, uh, you found any place for Arts Walk yet? To do Arts Walk shoot? Yeah. No? We should find out, uh, uh, maybe we could go... Should we try to call, like, Robert Cam? We try to use that studio. Maybe we can go to that studio. That's a possibility. We could also just set up like on the streets. Maybe find an outlet. Oh yeah. Do a little scouting. That'd be fun. Maybe we could go to. We just get. All we need to do is get power. Yeah. So We're, maybe we can run. Let's call Reese. Let's see if we can run a extension cord out of Reese's. Uh, what kind of monitor window. are you thinking of? Of you, are you trying to score anyway? We need a computer monitor. Oh. Uh. For this second computer. We have a second computer that was donated to us like a long time ago. Yeah. And okay. we just don't have another monitor for it. But this is a pretty good computer. And it actually has video stuff on it. So we could do like titles. And we have titles now, but we could do like live titles. Yeah, too bad. I threw out a monitor like two, uh, a month ago. Hello. Hello. Reese, Hello, Reese. answering. Hello, Daily Hour. Yeah, it's the program. How are you doing, Reese? I, I'm surprised you were you answered. Uh, I am as well. How are you doing? Uh, I'm doing very well. Hey, Reese, on Arts Walk, can we uh, run an extension cord out of your apartment onto the street to use power from there? Yes, you 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 can do that. Oh, great. Well, we'll have to talk to you about that later. But we're gonna I want to do the program from the streets outside of your apartment. Yeah, that sounds fun. All right. Uh, I'd be into that. So that's gonna be. Uh, I guess we're gonna have to reschedule. That's, that's on Friday, Friday or Saturday. Oh, let's, let's how about on Saturday? Friday and Saturday. Friday and Saturday. That's a good idea. Cause well, Nora, Nora is coming on Saturday, and she is the per person who we went to her studio for the other one anyway. So that's true. Maybe we yeah, should last go to her walk. studio on Saturday. Last but I think walk. Friday. Well, Saturday, Saturday afternoon, like at three. Yeah. How about Saturday at 3, Reese? Saturday at 3? Yes. Well, that's uh, what time yeah, we're going to start, so we'll meet you earlier than that, though. All right, yeah. I will, I'll, I'll be at home at that time. All right, well, well, we'll be talking to you about that, too. So I want to I also want to know about your your brothers. Last time you were on your... Remember, you, and then you went to Texas. Did you, uh, did you reconcile your brothers? So they were fighting. Oh, yeah. To, to tell... Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, so this is the whole story. Yeah, Reese's brothers. One of them, uh, one of them was uh, they were fighting over a woman. Oh no, that's and, awful. Uh, little, and they were they were friends. A little Jezebel. Then they they, uh, they 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 stopped talking to each other and they moved away from each other. Even though they were I think minors and living with their parents, one of them moved out of the parents' house. That's uh that's True. rough, man. So. Women. This is the resolve of this. This has been happening for months, and I've been talking about it on the program for a long time. So, how are they that, doing, Reese? Yeah. So they back together? Are they they're brothers again? They have they have reconciled. Wow! All the viewers can rest assured that at least at at this time they are they're friendly brothers again. Wow! Did you do that? I I did it a little bit in the sense that I I went home to my hometown. Where, where they live, and I think my presence inspired them to, to reconcile. Oh, great. Nice. Because they're, they're like, what are all these other problems? That's like, good. Wow, Reese is really chill all the time. Maybe we should calm down a little bit. Not, not, not sweat it. Bros before the hose, you know. Don't spray your bros with a hose. <laughs> um, so did they have a moment of reconciliation? Did they hug and cry? They, they, well, first, um, the, uh, the brother who was wronged, he, he punched the other brother. In, in a, but that punched was good. Him? That's a punched good resolution. Him? Yeah. He punched yeah. him? Oh, I just, I just stepped in a puddle. Oh. Yeah, it's wet out there. Oh, where, where are you right now? Um, I'm walking down the street, uh, in front of my apartment. Is I'm, uh, I'm at the Brotherhood. Oh, is anything happening there? 
not much. No Just hooligans? You got hanging out. Punching each other. Uh, what about? The, but the brothers, they Red they did people. reconcile. They did. They did reconcile. They did reconcile. They like, well, like we had a meeting. We had a meet up, uh, like a family meet up. Finally. <laughs> Inter intervention. Yeah, like a, a a family intervention, and um, they came together and they saw each other, and the younger one who had been wronged, who had been cheated on, he saw the other brother who was the cheater, and he was like, Atticus, I gotta punch you, dude. Yeah. Whoa. Warning, I'm gonna punch. <laughs> Hold on a second, dude. I just gotta punch you, and then everything will be fine. Was it a face punch? No, it was not a face. He did, he did like a number of quick jabs to the chest. Oh. Huh. And then he tried to do a karate kick, and Whoa. I, 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 I kind of like, I like cut that out pretty quick. I was like, guys, no, you don't karate kick each other. You kung fu blocked it. Yeah, you guys are adults now. You can't just go kung fu kicking each other. And then. But then after that, they did. They did. They like they reconciled immediately. Like, like after, like I think it was just like the violence. That was all they needed. And then yeah. after that, they were like, "Hey." They should have been right, allowed man. to do that before. I, I bet. I bet they're like your your family was like, "Don't fight." But sometimes, if it's a friendly, I mean not friendly, but kind of friendly fight, you know, you just want to get a little fighting out. Yeah. Between yeah. your family. No, that. My mother was was very opposed to the fighting. Yeah. But I think the fighting, but it was only, it wasn't even real, it, nobody was really, like, harmed long-term or anything, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no real damage done in the fight. Yeah. Well, that's good, that's a good, that was, like, a, one of the longest plots of the program, I think, that we've had. I mean, if it's, I mean, that's your life, too, Reese, but I think we're, that happened, like, uh, even way back in, in the, at the house, right? Oh, wow. Reese? Wait, wait, what are you they saying? They started fighting like Something... months ago. Oh, yeah, yeah. It was like a, that was like a two or three month plot, I think. Yeah. That's pretty exciting. Well, Reese, we'll see you on Saturday. Oh, yeah, yeah, we will. Saturday I'm, I'm afternoon really for it. in front of your house. Uh, wait, does in it even start? Is, does stuff even start in the afternoon? Should we do it in the evening? <laughs> wait, say again? Should we do it in the evening or in the afternoon? Because Arts Walk, does that even happen in the afternoon or? I think that uh, uh, Friday Arts Walk is all day into the evening, and then Saturday is just in the day. I mean, day. I would say probably do it, do it more towards the evening, because that's when it really starts, like, occurring. Saturday evening, or Friday evening. Maybe Saturday we should, evening, do, yeah. should we do Friday evening, or... Whoa, I've never even seen this one. Oh, yeah. Well, either one. I will, I'll be here either day. What do you think, Freddy? Sa or what, do you, what do you guys think? Luke, Friday? Friday or uh, do everything Friday. Well, Friday. Dance only dance work. happens Friday. So oh, do dance everything only dance. Friday. Yeah, we. Oh, you have to work on Friday <laughs> at yeah. night. Yeah. Is that the seventh? It's happening on the seventh or the fourteenth? On the seventh. Oh. Oh, so who's Bill? Oh, oh wait, Bill. I messed this up. I, oh. I I wrote I wrote your name on the calendar the wrong day. So yeah. yeah so, okay. The seventh and the eighth. So this is. Oh yeah, Bob. Bob and Bill. Bob and Bill. So we'll have to move one of Bob or Bill around, and we'll find out what's better for them. But I think let's do Saturday, like, night, like at 5.30-ish. Yeah, okay. that sounds good. 5.30? Yeah, or like 5 or maybe 6-ish. We should bring a, a one of those uh, things. Well, let's a tell light. Bill to be there. I bet Bill will want to go downtown. That'll be fun for Bill. You need a light. Yeah. You need a light. We'll have to get a, a, some lamps. Oh and wait, stuff. it's time for a commercial break. Well, Reese, we'll talk to you later. Okay, bye bye. All right, bye guys. Thanks, Billy Howard. Immersed in the internet, our computer monitor becomes an extension of our consciousness. Our computer monitor becomes an extension of our consciousness. We act like it's not true, but it is. You, you start to realize. Okay, 
Thanks, Roz Robert Cam. Yeah, he just showed me a new uh, a new track that he laid down. Ooh. Called the G7. It's like a parody of that song about the G6, which I've never really understood in the first place. But the G6 is a, a gun, right? Oh yeah. Is, what, is the G7 also a gun? Uh, is it a Glock? Is that a, not a real thing? G7 is, is it is a like Glock? Fake? G7 is a Glock, possibly. Oh. If you guys know what a Glock or a G7 is, call a program here. But yeah, we, I, we don't know. Yeah, I just Robert's saw Robert at the at the gross out oh. earlier today. Yeah, yeah. He's a. I mean, he's he's into making the the promos. That's good. We always put them on too late, though. He says that he can't watch the last half of the program because he can't stay up late enough, and then his DVR stops at, uh, at midnight. midnight. Yeah, that's that's annoying. Yeah, it's because. Comcast doesn't care about public access. Yeah. Uh, maybe we should try to get on NBC or something. Maybe yeah. We just yeah. Have a manager. Do you know any managers? N- NBC treats us a lot better. Yeah. Do you have any ins on the in the media industry? <laughs> <laughs> I wish. Yeah. But no, I don't. Okay. Yeah. How about you guys out there? Well, this one for the future, though. We'll we'll be able to watch people watching. Let's get the on the big peacock. The big peacock Let me network. See your peacock. Yeah, we're gonna get on NBC. We're gonna replace uh, the Leno there. <laughs> we're replacing him soon. Next week, guys. Uh, here, let's call another McDonald's. Yeah. Ooh, die yeah, yeah. Oh, look at that. Whoa, yeah. oh, whoa. Ooh, wipes. Wow. My God, that's that's nice. Yeah, oh, Freddie loves his switcher. He likes to play with it. Yeah, sure. that's true. And we should call Mike. Maybe I don't know if he stays up, but it's it's kind of late. But uh. Mike, huh? Mike Aiky, he's gonna fix this machine. Whoa! Arrowheads! Whoa. Whoa. Expanding arrowheads! Whoa! Let's see what this does. Freddy's oh, unlocking the all angles. Freddy's unlocking the secrets. You seen the? <laughs> the yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh look, you can change it while it's doing its thing. Whoa! 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 Yeah, look at all these secrets. Oh, and then it never stopped moving, changing it. This is a pretty crazy effect too. Oh well, did you see the? Did you ever see the Luma, the the Chroma Luma thing? No, show me the Chroma Luma the thing. The Chroma Luma thing is pretty good too. What's, oh, what the? Mm. What happened what now? What happened? Uh, did I break it? Oh no, they're both. They're all off here. So now, yeah. There's the Chroma Luma thing, but this thing is shit. Uh, the Chroma Luma thing? Yeah. Now it's not even. I don't even know how to get it to go. What's with this digitized motion? There it is. See this Whoa. thing? Whoa! So that's like Whoa! The green screen! The back. Yeah, green it's screen! Kinda, it's kind of like green screen, but uh... <laughs> that's green screen? That's like, well, I mean, it's, it's uh... Luma, Luma. It's Luma Chroma. Luma Chroma. That's pretty good. So Chroma's that's out a, the Luma. It's like... It's like the Luma effect, but it does yeah, Chroma Yeah, for those viewers also. out there who want to learn a little bit about, uh, com- or I guess video wow. technology, the difference between a Luma key and a Chroma key is that a Luma key keys out the bright or the dark stuff. And in fact, if you hit that twice, I bet you can, uh, yeah, you can, well, no. Oh, yeah, what's what's happening now? This is uh, clock cam. Oh. So go back to Luma. A minute. See yeah, oh, see, it's in the background and on my shirt. <laughs> All the yeah. light stuff gets it, huh? Yeah, it's the light. The lightest stuff gets keyed out, as opposed to in a chroma key, where you choose the uh, you choose the, uh, what color you want to key out of a thing. So luma key kind of makes is light and dark. See now you're repeating yeah. out back into the background there, Luke. You see, see? You see yourself there. Infinite Several Luke. times there's three. Infinite uh, regress of Luke. Recursion. Luke recursion. Yeah. Luke exception. So this is some kind of things we're doing here with the with the new effects with the luma effects here. It's Freddy's hand, yeah. It's pretty exciting. These are some new video stuff we can do with the new mixer. We haven't completely explored the, the realms of the mixer yet. Yeah, well, can you do it from... Uh, oops. Uh, we should... Can we do it from... Like, flip these? Oh, we can, but... Yeah, then it's doing a thing. That's a pretty good thing. That's like the crazy little Whoa. effect there. Oh, oh, yeah. There you are. Hey, wow, thing. that's pretty fun. Yeah. So, um, well, yeah, we're going to do some of the stuff. I don't know. We've got to figure out the... the um, what we're gonna do for the 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 thing? 
on, oh, a, yeah, the, on a, the arts walk yeah, thing. That's weird. I can't. It's I know we're gonna have to bring all these VCRs and stuff to that. Oh, you know, uh, Steve Jobs is dead. Oh yeah, this just in, guys. Cancer. Last week, yeah, you guys probably all know about this already because uh, you hear about all the news here last. Yeah. Everybody, so if you're trying to look for news, uh, we're slow, little slow on the news. But if you want to reminisce about last week when Steve Jobs died, that happened. Yeah, everyone. The it's program everyone is the catching place. up. It's everywhere. Everyone's talking about it all day today. It's the most interesting thing on the internet, I guess. Yeah, especially because he's think. kind of the, an internet guy, so. Now in the day of the internet, it's like, oh wow, that's a bigger internet deal there. People are into the... Yeah, so Steve Jobs, he's on the... He did TV stuff, and uh, I mean, did he, he? Did the inter- he did the internet stuff, not TV stuff. He, he made micro, or not Microsoft, the other one. Uh, Apples. Yeah. Apples. Apple computers. Macintosh uh, PC revolution. See, and he died uh, almost... A week ago. He, he, <laughs> kept, he kept a pretty good uh, health media thing like I thought it was, he apparently oh. had cancer for a while and I had no idea about that and he died of cancer which seems like it takes a long time to do but it was like oh he's dead what well and yeah and yeah. they even apparently caught it pretty quickly it's a pancreatic cancer which is has only a 5% survival rate oh. supposedly so it's like it's kind of the worst one of the worst cancers you can get I guess but yeah. usually peop- and it's like got no symptoms usually you can't detect it until people start turning yellow. What is that called? Uh, jaundice. Jaundice. And then, I mean, I think that there's even some people who you know who have had that happen to their loved ones. So it's a it's a dangerous cancer, definitely. Yeah, look out for that. Yeah, but, but he yeah, he he just like I'm gonna resign. Yeah. But he probably knew he was gonna die. It was I guess. Yeah, I think. It, but it was like, oh, he's gonna resign. Why would he do that? But uh, you know, he he was like 55 or whatever. He, he wasn't that old. And uh, he was a bazillionaire, you know, but he's dead, so. Where's that money going to go? Yeah. You know, out there, you guys, maybe you want to try to get all that money, but, you know, you could just get <laughs> just get cancer or something, so. I don't know if they're correlated. Yeah. Maybe. Oh, money maybe it was all the cell phones used. Maybe it was from iPhone. He, he used his iPhone too much. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Or he yeah. put his iPhone next to his pancreas too much. Yeah. People, people actually they do say that, they, you know, they're like, don't put your phones up to your head. But then you put it in your pocket next to your like uh, testicles or ovaries, and those are some b- pretty bad uh, those cancers. Are important, you know, so. Those are important parts of your body. Yeah, and they those are, those are like pretty common cancers too. So I mean, you put your phone down there instead with the Bluetooth stuff. They're like, don't put it by your brain. So it's pretty pretty freaky stuff. Uh, but I like it when you had the uh, red and the and the blue going at the same time. I was part. Democratic and part Republican. Yeah. At the same time. All sides here in. Uh, or American, yeah. Yeah. I bet, I bet Steve Jobs did expose himself to a lot of chemicals in the early days when he was like building the computers, right. and getting hands on, and like lots of lead or <laughs> like um, soldering is like lead and stuff. But I don't know if that that lead poisoning is not doesn't give me any cancer. But maybe maybe I don't know. Everything does. I don't know if he was out there on the floor actually building the computer. He was in the in the first in the first couple of ones <laughs> he did that apparently he did out of his garage I think. That's the problem with getting yeah. good at something. I bet that there was the part that he enjoyed the most. I bet. I mean he's a good manager and knows about stuff. But I wonder if that was his true passion was managing Apple or like building a computer. You know. Yeah. Who's gonna be so the new? You got a, maybe you guys have already talked about this, but you got the big uh, October dance or dance episode coming up on the seventh, right? Yeah, it's so big. Well, yeah, like it's, it's dressed up like crazy, right? It's conflicting with Arts Walk, and and uh, many people who would otherwise choose dance or dance are, are going to choose Arts Walk instead. Mm. Well, I, yeah, I mean, I uh, I heard about it on the internet though. Some people in the Olympia community online. Like, hey, are you guys going to dance a dance? And then I was, and then no way. Yeah, they think they're gonna go. I, I know that at least All two right. people from that little forum thing are gonna go. So, yeah. And well, thank goodness for the people at that little forum. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So that's fun. I, I'm, I'm excited. I like, I like the. Uh, what is going on there? I like, huh? Oh yeah. Huh. I like, uh, I like the, the Halloween episode because it's the one. Where I mean, most people usually dress up and stuff, but it's the one where like, what was the craziest costume you've seen from uh, October Dance Only Dance Halloween <laughs> episode? <laughs> I don't know. I, yeah, I think I've seen better costumes. 
on uh, December episodes or something. Oh, yeah, yeah. They Christmas dressed up like Santa Claus. No, ketchup bottles. What? I'm still a f- uh, I'm still a big fan of the of the woman who dressed up like a ketchup bottle. Cats up. Did she make ketchup. it herself or? No, it looks like a store bought thing, but mm-hmm. you know, you know, kudos to uh, people who dress up like ketchup bottles. Yes. <laughs> you know, non sequitur. <laughs> <laughs> I, went, I went to the Halloween store today. Oh, oh yeah. my gosh. And I saw a bunch of dummies. It makes me want to kind of get a, a mannequin for the program on s- for solo days. Oh, that's a good idea. To get an extra like skull man. Yeah. We could buy wow. uh, buy like ghost face from Scream. Yeah, either that. Or, yeah, you could make. I mean, we could make one too. Yeah, just plaster cast your face and just have a second. A candy. double one. Yeah. Oh man, so on the outside guess. of that store, they got this picture of this of this girl's head with a wig on it. Mm-hmm. And I'm really turned on by that special that particular oh. kind of wig that she was wearing. Oh, it's a uh, sexy like wig. There's a sexy wig out there. kissed uh, Sue Reynolds earlier. He's a... Uh, I kissed he pictures. Likes <laughs> Ooh, yeah, that's good. <laughs> he likes images of women. Well, Sue Next time I'm on the program, I'll, I'll show you what I'm talking about. The this this wig. Wig. I'll tell you a story about it. Kate's It'll, got it'll a be wig. really exciting. Yeah. Is that pink wig or... Yeah, it's a pink wig. Yeah, those are good. Also, today is the Columbus Day special, Freddy. Oh, happy Columbus Day out there, everybody. Yeah. Remember happy when you had Columbus. a nice uh, country? Yeah. What is it? What is it? We don't even know. I'm trying to figure it out. I don't people, people get upset about Columbus Day in Olympia. Yeah, that's what that's what Luke was saying. That's what his first reaction was, was the... Genocide yeah. Day. Genocide Day, but... Yeah. I mean, I don't know. Did they just wish that America had never been discovered? Yeah. I mean, probably, maybe, yeah. But probably wish that. Yeah. It's hard to for but things like, to happen. That's that's, it, that's inevitable. You know, it was it was inevitable for it. We'd still to be get over. We white people would still be over in Europe. We'd be doing the program over in Europe. Maybe, of, right. Yeah, maybe, but I mean, someone would have discovered America. It's like none of us pretty would, big. None of us would be <laughs> here. It's in now. the way of things. <laughs> none of us would be here now if it wasn't for the genocide of millions. So yeah. if you guys didn't like that, then <laughs> you don't you, you don't want to be alive. I guess you're not a proud American, are you? No. We're proud of yourself, though. You wouldn't be alive. You would, you would erase yourself from history. Yeah, it's true. But, be, yeah, what if somebody, what if, like, a god came over and gave you a choice and said, okay, you can undo all that genocide, but you wouldn't exist anymore. What do you, cho- what do you choose? It's you a know? greater good question. That's you a know? tough one. Yeah. I personally like my life, and <laughs> I, don't, I don't think that I am responsible for Christopher Columbus. No, the God's not saying anything about yeah. responsibility. Right. Not no, so uh, through, through not feeling incredibly responsible personally, I would say, oh, man, that sounds awful. Yeah, I'm it? not, it sounds yeah, bad. yeah. It's, it, those <laughs> are bad choices. Thank, thank goodness that we don't have to make these choices in, <laughs> in life. And that we can just <laughs> Damn you, space <laughs> God. <laughs> Why the hell would you even ask me that? <laughs> <laughs> it was, yeah, space, space-time continuum, that's bad stuff. Good thing we're on a re- we're here in reality. I know that in TV it seems like maybe we should be able to just uh, zoom zoom to the past, stop Christopher Columbus or something. But zoom zoom. Yeah. But I don't so know we don't we don't condone we don't condone the genocide of, of millions no, of people. Not. So. But uh, there's that. I'm trying to think. I was trying to think of what what uh, Columbus Day you're supposed to do. You know, like I know what it, the history of Columbus and everything is, but what's the point of Right. Having a day based on him. I mean, isn't that kind of like what Thanksgiving's for? Yeah. You know? It's another genocide day. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> but it's like it's pretty much yeah. celebrating the same thing, I guess. Yeah. Everything, your whole life is genocide life, if you think about it that way. That's what I was, I'm saying by the whole... Oh, whole yeah. Thing, as so. long as you enjoy all the benefits of modern life here in the Western world, you know, you're, you're yeah. supporting something, some sweatshop somewhere that's killing somebody, you know? You've got blood in your hands, viewers. It happened yeah. before you are born... You're and watching don't TV. worry about it. You're watching TV right now, and that TV is being transferred through the wires on the backs of thousands of dead people. Yeah. yeah. Darn it. No, oh, that's 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 too bad. It's a downer. Sorry. See, yeah, I think every time I try to think of what you do on Columbus Day, I'm just thinking of Thanksgiving things. So I was like, right. oh yeah, you, you do that Eat a turkey with the hand. And you yeah. like you like do your hand, but that's. That's all Thanksgiving. And then I was like, oh, the Mayflower. But no, the Mayflower is also a Thanksgiving pilgrim thing, too. So yeah, Peace out, everybody. Oh, oh you got to go? Bye, Luke. Hey, thanks for being on the show. Bus. Luke. Got to hit that bus. Yeah, we you are a great guest. Thanks, yeah, Luke. thanks. Uh, you, be, you guys are a great guest, too. You want to come back Everybody's on the show? a great guest. You want to come back at the end of the month, Luke? Probably. You can come schedule. back on Saturday, even. Come come to uh, the yeah. Arts Walk. It'll be outside. What, on, nearby Saturday. The come on Saturday. How about also on Friday the 28th? What are the streets there? Friday the 28th? 
All right, well, I'm going to pick Pebble you in. Night. I, I plan on the use of pen, but I will cross you out, possibly. Goodbye, bro. He's that pencil. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. Well, we're getting down to the finale. Oh, don't. No. Yeah, Luke yeah. is going to forget his jacket. There he goes. Bye, Luke. <laughs> we both went with the camera angle. I was going to get him out going out the door, but... Oh, yeah, I just wanted slow. to get another... Frank <laughs> block me. Sorry. <laughs> no, yeah, you just, you've seen him before. Yeah. That's good. I encourage other people to use the machines too. The, just um, touch them. Yeah. See what you can do. Sometimes I've seen be, uh, guests just totally um, wipe wipe out. Yeah. Just yeah. they they do something and they don't know what they did and then all of a sudden the the machine is just you know like on white back color forever and you don't know what's happening. It's like we're on the radio. Yeah. So we're well, yeah, it's like, you know, no matter what happens, it's always a... Yep. Oh. Oops. Yep. So we're going to try to, I don't know, Cut up. celebrate things. You know, for all the bad things Columbus did, we are we, 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 are thankful. we are thankful for him for bringing him to us to life. <laughs> Thank you. I'm giving thank The thing I'm thankful for this Columbus Day... <laughs> Well, I mean... My entire existence is based off of Christopher Columbus I, I in think, a small way. I think that... Yeah, exactly. Thanks, Christopher. But I think that... I bet that he wasn't as bad of a guy. I think that his actions perhaps caused a lot of things that he wouldn't condone himself. Like, he didn't seem like too bad of a guy, maybe. I don't know, though. Yeah, that's a pretty big general yeah, generalization that Christopher Columbus caused the genocide of... I bet, I bet Christopher Columbus... Columbus killed very few people himself, right. or even wanted to kill anybody. He he was just trying to explore. Right. He had a spirit of adventure that he was really trying to go for, and and he was kind of not very good at it too. You know, yeah. like he was trying to find India. Oh yeah, he named the Indians. That's like another big political or political PC thing because like, it's the genocide. But then he he called Indians Indians. Yeah. And they're, but they're from India, but they're native, the Native Americans. That's the thing. I guess I can be upset for him for not being politically correct. Yeah. He should have called them the Native Americans. Oh, one minute left. I wonder, are we are we broadcast onto the reservations? We might be. Ooh. And if you guys maybe. watch it out there, uh, the Native Reservations, you guys can call the program, too. I want to hear how about you feel about Columbus Day. So that's pretty good. Tomorrow we have, uh, well, if Angie is has... Appendicitis. If she's done with that, do you know about that? Um, I saw Angie the other day. She seemed all right. All right. Well, she's scheduled for the program tomorrow, but she didn't answer her phone. We'll see if she shows up. And then on Friday we have Bob and uh, Bobette. Now who's? Oh, they're gonna do Anarchy Hour. That's a that's something to look forward to on yeah. Friday. Anarchy Hour on Friday with Bob and Bobette, which is probably gonna be pretty calm. Yeah. I, I don't. Think I mean, it'll be too much anarchy. I guess. One of the well, we'll I mean, one help. of the things, one of the mis. Uh, conceptions about anarchy is that it always has to be wild and dangerous. Okay. Maybe. Yeah, well, they could they could do something bad, though, so tune in for that. No rules. Yeah, potential badness, so. And then on Saturday, yeah, the Arch Walk, thanks everybody. No gods, no masters. Yeah. Go to our did website. You did you notice the thing in the intro yet? What's From different? The light seriously? No, no, no. I mean that too. Yeah, but uh, the song's backwards. Oh, I knew that. Oh. <laughs> There's like a lot of things that happen. But like, you know the one thing? Yeah, but like, who knows what the one thing is? Yeah. I guess. <laughs> I noticed that in the in the, uh, in the live show. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm not good at being cryptic. I guess. Thanks, viewers. Thanks for watching. Thanks, TCTV. Thanks, hey, and Dan. Let's, let's thank our sponsors, yeah. too. That's LeBebe. Thanks, LeBebe. Check her out on, on the internet. Hell yeah, dog. Hell yeah, dog. And also, uh, Cornerstone. It's a restaurant. Thanks, Cornerstone. Bye-bye. <laughs>